What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Oli. Welcome back to the Amount of Oz. Thanks for tuning to another video. Yes, uh, today we're going to be doing a reaction video to Agent Zero Two. I think that's what it is. Agent Zero Two. Means that only NBA fans will understand. Alright. Oh, damn. I need some tea. I don't have my tea yet. And you're probably like, alright, is this a V-neck? Nah, this is supposed to be a regular t-shirt. I just get it stretched out like this. See, look. I'm, I'm a turtle. Your mom's gonna be like, oh, are you gonna change it before you start the video? I could have, but I didn't. I chose not to. Don't, just don't want to. Just me. But anyway, uh, so yeah, let's get into the video. If you're new to the channel, hit the smash the like button, subscribe, comment down below, and turn on post notification every time I upload you guys will know. Alright, so let's get into it. We're exploring past the realm of 2K memes. We're talking NBA memes today. It's a little hot. Let me turn the goddamn AC up. God damn, it's 76 degrees right now. Shams put out this tweet on Twitter saying, Multiple tips have been placed in the NBA's anonymous hotline to report protocol violations on campus, sources tell The Athletic. Okay. And oh man, the replies was full of juiciness. <laughs> Here we have Chris all the off. Snitching. Here we go again, man. And he doesn't have a competitive spirit, though. You feel me? I think. I don't know. Uh, Chris Paul, I can't help you on this one. This is a good quality meme. It's a cool 7 out of 10, man. Here we have Kawhi Leonard on his phone smiling and Pat Bev is smiling looking at him. Pat Bev tried to sell me crack. Oh my god. Why would you sit on your own teammate? That doesn't even make sense. Kawhi was picking up DoorDash. <laughs> Yes, these are good quality memes right here, ladies and gentlemen. Yo, bro, basketball is a competitive sport. Listen, man, I'm a competitive kind of guy. I'm saying whatever I need to say to get Kawhi Leonard up the game. Kevin Durant would never break protocol. He'd never let his team down like that. Look, guys, we have a Kevin Durant burner Twitter meme right here. I'm not going to lie to you, these burner, burner Twitter memes is kind of old, but at the same time, we're rehashing it on a new topic. Back. It is kind of funny. Eight out of ten. We got Chris Paul in Orlando. <laughs> <laughs> this is <laughs> it's crazy. I'm getting so much real joy out of this, man. Yo, am I bugging? A few years ago, didn't like Chris Paul when he was on the Clippers? Did he get in some drama where he like went into the other team's locker room? Bro, what happened there? I forgot. Chris Paul. <laughs> But I hope something leaks about Chris Paul tattletailing, man. That will be pure comedy. Oh, this is a good one. Kevin Durant is the only player I know following all the rules. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. He's not even hey, in the bubble. You know what's funny? This is what I love about the internet. In the midst of all the doom and all the gloom, all the all the goddamn negativity and chaos going on in the world, man. Look here, we got the internet just making fun out of a difficult situation, man. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Man, yeah. look what we have here. Yeah, love it and hate it. It's like everything just flipped on his head, man. We got Kawhi Leonard with giant smiles across his. Have we? I didn't even know what his teeth looked like till just now, man. Bro, Facts. everybody is complaining and miserable in these bummy hotels because they're coming from their 20,000 square foot mansions and stuff. And Kawhi Leonard is just having the time of his life. He's like, he doesn't even have a hairstylist there. He said, fuck all of that. I'm just enjoying my life right now. Yeah. Okay, uh, so I'm on Instagram from, from now and again, and I came to the conclusion that NBA memes comes out with the funniest memes on the internet, man. And so I'm about to go through and rate some of these, and I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. I don't expect to see nothing under a five, all right? Because these are supposed to be picked and chosen, man. You just basically booped this off the internet. It's not like they created this themselves, so it has to be the funniest memes. I came with high Facts. expectations, man. First up, LeBron makes an open three. LeBron's the next possession. <laughs> is it accurate? Yeah. <laughs> you be doing that, especially for game-winning shots. When it's a game-winning shot, LeBron doesn't care where he's shooting from. He just knows it's going to go in. Yeah. Accurate, kind of funny, 7 out of 10. Rashawn Holmes when getting food, food outside, outside the bubble. bubble. <laughs> Yo, we all want to see the NBA resume. We need y'all to follow the rules and stop inviting these thotties to your crib, man. God damn. I don't damn. know, but I, I saw that. Yo, bro, um, a week into the bubble, there was reports that, like, internet and Instagram models was being invited. 
Which one of y'all did that? We just want to see y'all <laughs> again, bro. Y'all can fuck any girl in the world immediately after all this is over, guys, okay? Just play but ball. until then, all you guys should be celibate. You're too embarrassed Fast. to wear a mask, but you're wearing a face to see out in public. <laughs> Hey, shout out to the guys in New York, man. Struggling Knicks fans out there, you feel me? Y'all need like a second team or something. RIP to the New York Knicks. Y'all really need some love, man. You need double the odds, because it's something about New York teams and just zero success in anything except football. I feel for y'all, though, bro. You know, the Raptors, that, that is so true. New York, your football team suck. Your basketball team suck. Oh, the Yankees, eh, eh. I don't watch baseball, so I can't really comment on it. But your basketball and football, both of your teams suck. Like, the Brooklyn Nets is the only thing that can probably save us if y'all get Kyrie and direct now. That was us for a while, you feel me? But the, the, the times have changed, man. We're NBA champions now. Yup. MLS champions just a couple years ago, too. Yup. CFL champions just a couple years before that, too. Yup. What even is this? What, what is C C C F L? Don't even age it. Come on. What what is that? That don't exist. Come on. We all CFL is where the reject NFL players go. Get it right. Almost were ML MLB World Series champions. We had Jose Bautista on. And besides the point. Besides the point. Simmons dropped that fish right on the floor. Man can't make anything. Yes, sir. He ain't missed the ocean, did he? Oh. God damn it, Thanksgiving! <laughs> there was a whole ocean! Actually, not a ocean. Imagine losing in the fourth OT, game seven of the Eastern Conference Finals to the CPU like this. I already know some bullshit about to pop off. No, not not Ben Simmons. Who are these guys? Oh. Oh, nah, he hit a full court shot. He did, just by the way, this one. <gasps> oh. I, I have never seen a shot land like that. In the decade I've been playing 2K, I've never seen that. To the point where I genuinely think this is CGI. Because <laughs> it doesn't oh, look real. Man. How Bron's bedroom looks like in the bubble. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> they probably gave him the four floor penthouse suite, 6,000 square feet with views across the Pacific Ocean. God damn it, man. I can lie, that does look lavish, you feel me? I, I kinda wanna stay there for a night. LeBron probably built it himself. He's just built different. Facts. <laughs> you know what's funny? In these memes you be seeing on Instagram, the, the goddamn comments is just as funny as the meme itself. Adam Silver, why did you leave the bubble? NBA player. I'm sorry, I just wanted a frosty. <laughs> That's just like a simple, you know what I'm saying? And it's like, yeah, there was so many better ways to execute on that meme. I'm gonna sit here, man, and after contemplating on it for a good little while, and by a good little while, I mean five seconds, I'm gonna have to give you a four out of ten. Hey, bro, look what they got them eating. And <laughs> it's LeBron and AD. Just. <laughs> nah, man. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I you know, didn't mean the whole The season will be forfeited if LeBron got sick. That would be so unfortunate, because I feel like LeBron is the only player where if he got injured or sick, man, it's over. They're just going to say, <laughs> fuck it. Because the season is going to have an asterisk regardless, you feel me? And, and, and so it's kind of messed up, because when the Raptors are back to back champions, no one's going to respect that second championship the way they respected the first, the first championship. One. Yep. Describe your favorite sports moment as boring as possible. <laughs> Chris Boss said, I got a rebound and made a pass. And this is where Skip Bayless would jump in and tell us all about how Ray Allen saved LeBron's legacy in Game 6, and he's the only reason why, and if it wasn't for Ray Allen. We all been through that, so I'm not gonna put you guys through that, man, alright? Depressed Knicks fan says, the Knicks won a game. <laughs> uh... Uh, I'm not gonna lie, everybody in Toronto disliked Chris Bosch the entirety of his stay in Miami. Because we was just like, man, you was doing that with us. And before Chris Bosch got injured. I remember we was like the third seed in the Eastern Conference. He got injured. We didn't even make the playoffs. He was an important part of the team. He left and broke our heart. How Gasol spending time with Kobe's daughters is so heartwarming. I seen this on on Twitter. This is the sweetest, most wholesome, oh, genuine stuff I've seen on the internet all week, man. This is how That's NBA good. courts are looking like. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no way. Wait, 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 what? They should all be full right now. Now the meme is not accurate. Hold on now. It's no, it's in right the here. bubble. Them, all of this should be full because they all... It's inside the bubble. The court, they had it inside the little conference room. That's how it is. Practicing right now. Hey, the accuracy is kind of... But it's funny though. 
But the accuracy is kind of... I'm going to have to give you a 6 out of 10. Ben Simmons seems to have expanded his shooting range. In the, oh, my God. We're going to do this every offseason with a new player. Guys, all of these NBA players, goddamn Kendrick Perkins can hit threes consistently in practice. I guarantee you, bro. But then when NBA lights are yeah. shining, the audience is talking shit. It's not like that, man. Everybody buckles under the pressure. Oh, this is a troll. Okay, never mind. <laughs> 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 oh man, look at Ben Simmons, man. That's so why they're moving them to power four. Lakers and four. We out the trenches. The oh, Clippers not built like this. Oh, I had no idea. I didn't mean to interrupt the video or bring a guest to interrupt for the first time. I feel like you did this on purpose, though. Am I wrong? Just oh, hey please. man. Hey, hey. How y'all doing, man? Just, what hey, what would you rate this meme right here? Lakers and four. We out the trenches. The Clippers not built like this. This is Jared Smith smoking a little. Black and That's a 6 out of 10. You know why? Why? Because the Lakers won in their three. Oh. oh. He just walked into the door. He just walked into the door. <laughs> oh. He's wrong. Uh, that's a bad meme. 3 out of 10. I override his decision. Well, I'm done with Trump now. Yo! Jared Smith officially signed with the Lakers. Hennessy. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Shady made this. Yes, uh, sir. That's my guy. Hey, what's he doing? <laughs> why are they fighting over the ball, man? Okay, ISO! ISO! Come on, JR! Oh, that's Cash! Oh, yeah. That's not even accurate, though, Shane. Right. That was Nick Young who did that. Westbrook loading up 2K21 and seeing Lillard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I've been through that, man. Uh, Young was in a game and you know it's some bullshit and it's Ronnie's fault. Everyone's felt like this before. That's such a relatable feeling, man, right there, bro, in the top of the fact. Okay, let me pull out something. In my opinion, I really don't feel like Zion should be on the cover, one of the kind of cover athletes of 2K. My opinion, I just don't feel like he's proven himself. I really feel like, let me see, uh, somebody else should get that position. I really believe in that. The My opinion. The fact is that, that the memes caption is fucking A1. 9 out of 10. The NBA is back in exactly 30 days. And you got the goosebumps. You got the shivers, man. Because that's really <laughs> an orgasmic feeling. I mean, you have a bitch whisper that into your ear. You can't help but feel roused. You feel me? Like this no. That's weird. Over, over man sweating. If ends wants or butts about it, man. 10 out of 10. LeBron before he shoots a three. <laughs> hey, what are you doing here, man? Why? What's the point? You know I'm gonna hit this. <laughs> Jared yeah. Smith showing up to the Staples Center. Yeah. <laughs> First of all, ah. iconic episode, my favorite episodes of all television of all time. Feel me. Second of all, captions on point. A is so damn potentially <laughs> accurate. It's funny because we all walked into the wrong class before. You feel me? Like you had the wrong thing. Maybe he was looking at your schedule incorrectly. Wrong class. Yeah. You printed it out incorrectly. Jared Smith might incorrectly show up to the wrong stadium. You don't know patience unless you've been through this. <laughs> it's a quality meme. You feel me? And it's very... Very relatable. We survived though, man, because we're troopers. And this is a good quality. I mean, when I first saw it, I thought it was a nine, but now that I've seen it already, I think it's a seven. LeBron at 12 a.m. on July 30th. Hey, is that when they're starting back up? Are you mean to tell me in two weeks we can see basketball again? I'm not gonna lie to you. It's yeah. gonna be so happy to see basketball again. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Vince Carter was the last active NBA player to appear on the Nintendo 64. Those graphics, though. Huh? Yeah. That's beautiful. In fact, I did a video playing with Vince Carter in every single 2K, the original one that dropped in 1999 all the way to 2K20. Link in the description and the end screen. All right, y'all. Well, I can watch that. I think it's at like a million views now. It shit blew up. It's crazy. I know, guys. Thank you. Thank you for showing love. Remember, remember how unrealistic it was in NBA 2K18 to getting into the NBA? Yeah, you had to talk to DJ, and then you went to the little tryout thing, and then... Wait, what happened? Oh, look at the top comment. <laughs> B-Fresh was the most annoying character in the history of Giddy. I'm glad everybody knows that. I wonder what B-Fresh is up to right now. This is her. Sherry Cola. What is she doing right now? Is she in movies and stuff? She's in a show called Good Trouble, Claws, Lovely. Oh, she's been, ah, she been doing her thing. Yo, why do I hate her? <laughs> Um, I don't know her, but just because she made my life considerably more miserable that year where everybody was depressed, I genuinely dislike her, and I don't know her. Hey, uh, be fresh. Can we get you on the podcast next time you're in Atlanta? Uh, you know what I'm saying? We can squash our differences. Feel me? Oh, hold on, there's a fly in my face. Hey, man, if y'all enjoyed the video, drop a like. Subscribe. 
All right, so that's the end of this segment of um, what it is memes that only NBA fans understand. Well, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Smash the like button, comment down below, and I'll be back with the next video with my beat up T-shirt. We out. Peace.